Welcome. Uh, today the topic is really IP subnetting made so easy. Subnetting it's an important skill to have as a network engineer and after working many years in the industry um, I've found a way to make subnetting easy, straightforward uh, for you and I'd like to share that with you today and I hope you enjoy it. Now I have an IP address here as you can see uh, 10.20.4.13.29 and I need to know um, which subnet address it's, uh, it, or block it belongs to and uh, the valid host or the uh, subnet mask, the broadcast address and things like that. So the step one and uh, for me is find the subnet number. The subnet number is always found by deducting the prefix from 32. So subtract so prefix number, which is 29, from 32. So 32 minus 29 is 3. Now, the subnet mask, if you want to find that, um, it's easy. If you've done your CCN and CCNP or any other networking uh, courses, N plus, Network Plus from CompTIA, um, you know that this 8 bits uh, 128, 64, 32, 16, 8, 4, 2, 1. It's your, um, your go-to tool to de derive what subnet uh, mask that this sits on, okay? Now, this is the formula I use. So the subnet mask is always the 8 bits minus the 3 bits you discovered now when you deducted the 29, 32. And so that is 8 minus 3 and that's 5. So the network bit turned on uh on ones are five so one two three four five that falls on the eight yeah you realize that two raised to the power three two raised to the power three is two times two four four times two eight eight so that confirms that this eight is valid okay so you've discovered the similar number the similar mask number you get you've seen that you've seen that the similar size is eight so if it's 8, then of course it starts from 0. So this is going to be 10, the 20, the 4, the 0. Then the next one is 10, the 20, the 4, the 8. The next one is 10, the 20, the 4, the 16. Uh, like over here. So you find your broker size. The broker's ad um, address size um, is always the subnet size, which is the one you discovered here, minus 1. Okay. And the next block will be that one plus whatever you, you this one plus uh, that's the block size plus the similar size minus one that you discovered for the broker's address so from zero to eight the broker's address is eight minus one which is seven now from eight to sixteen the broker's address will be yes you guessed right sixteen minus one and that will be fifteen and then from sixteen to twenty four the broker's address will be uh, 24 minus 1 which is 23 so you locate your IP address in the appropriate subnet block so it's 10 to 20 to 4 to 13 so I'm interested in this last octet here 13 is not in between 0 and 8 but of course it's not in between 16 and 24 it is between 8 and 16 so the subnet address uh, over here is uh, 10 to 20 to 4 to 8 because 14 falls in between 8 and 16 the summit, summit uh, 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 broker's address, the broker's address is 15. Uh, the valid hosts are between, you start from 9, and then it will end uh, on 14 because 15 is the broker's address. So the valid host to cover the valid host is always 2 is the power, what you discovered earlier, minus 2. And for me, it was 8 minus 2, and that's 6. So uh, if it was zero, it would have been one, two, three, four, five, six. The seven would be the broker's address. And so this is the step I use uh, to get this done. Um, I hope it's useful for you. But let's solve this one. Um, 10 to 20 to 4 to 8. Um, 14 is the maximum host address. 9 is the minimum host address. Broker's address is 15. And so that's the formula. Um, feel free to take a screenshot of this. Feel free to do anything with this. But let's convert this, um, change this one here. 
and let's go 27 another, another one so 27 I know 27 to 32 is 20, 32 minus 27 and that's gonna give me 5 now 5 okay going to be 3 so 24 25 26 27 so this is going to be 0 that's going to be 0 and so it's going to be 255 255 and then uh, it was a slash 27 so this is 27 what do we get for a slash 27 let's calculate that so um, 255 255 255 is 24 so 25, 26, 27, so that's 128 plus 64, 192 plus 32, and that is 224. So it's going to go here, and it's going to be 224. So we've discovered our, our uh, southern mask, okay, slash like 27 is 224, and you can use the calculator or anything else there. Now let's find the southern size. We said 2 is the power of 5. Two times two times two times two. Two times two four four two eight eight six times two times two thirty two. So now I do know my summer size is going to be two is the power of five minus one. So that's gonna be thirty two minus one and that is thirty one. So it's going to be zero. So I block thirty two sixty four to sixty four plus two three eight ninety six. So now without much locate IP address and subnet four thirteen thirteen falls between zero and thirty two. Okay so i know it belongs to this subnet here and um its broadcast address um, is 31 usable address is between 1 and 30. between 1 and 30. so um so that's how it works oh hang on a second of course i let's to calculate valid host 2 is the power of 5 minus 2 and that is 32 minus 2 and that is 30 and that confirms what I said about 0 to 30 so this the 0 is some address you cannot use that but you can use the first minimum host dot 1 and you can use the last minimum host that is the 30 and then and then the broadcast address is 31 you cannot use that and of course 32 is a nest subnet so um, this is how you do it and I hope um, it's useful and if you've learned something feel free to take a screenshot of this uh, write it write this down and use it for any change the prefix any how you want and just go through the system and you would always be guaranteed good results so thank you for viewing and I'll see you on the next one uh, like share subscribe um, comment ask questions what have you i'm available to respond when i can but thank you for viewing thank you for stopping by and press the notification button and you will hear from me on my next video bye bye